Yeah. Hello, hello, people. Good evening. Nice to have you one more time. Good evening, teacher. Hi, how are you? Yeah, I'm fine. Everything good? That's great. It's nice to see you one more time. Thank you so much for being here. Uh, thank you so much for being here. It was still like... um. We still have classes to miss you. Working with section number three. That's the one we're working on. Okay, so we're still gonna have like one, two more classes about this section. Okay, um, let me show you what it does. Today, as far as I remember, it's class number seven, right? That is the one we're gonna have today, okay? This is intermediate module number one, and this is class number seven. We're gonna work with expressing wishes. That's the thing we're going to work today. Thanks for you. And I hope you had a great, a really great vacation. Well, thank you so much for being here on time. And we'll start working on this one. Um, which is expressing wishes. That is the thing we're going to work um, on today's class. Thank you so much for being here on time. Welcome, welcome, welcome. <clears throat> Buenas noches, teacher. Hello, Camilo, that's you, right? Uh, yeah, yes, I, I am. Oh, how are you? Nice to be here. Thank you. My pleasure as well. Nice. To okay, nice. how was your vacations? Oh, that was quite quite good. Yeah, it was quite good. It's like... All right. Uh, nice to hear that. Oh, thank okay. you. Yeah, nothing, um, but I was expecting, like, everything was expensive outside. Too expensive, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, uh, maybe I don't know why, because I thought was, I, I was getting that rich, or maybe yeah. everything is expensive outside because it's like, uh, I mean, food, um, I mean, everything is just quite expensive. Yeah, that's we went to, we, 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 I went with my family, you know, my my wife and my two daughters, and we ate churritos, all the stuff, but in lunch, we went out, you know, to eat some hamburgers. Because in that was so expensive. Yeah. 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 Uh, uh, that's unfortunately, right? That's 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 not good. Yeah. Because yeah. it's like I now with this social media, um let's say um I don't know. With this social media, I don't know, like good evening, teacher. But good evening, thank you so much for being here. Um uh, I don't know how to say that. Uh, let's say boom that we have, right? Like every everybody is like recording and recommending to you places where you can go and spend your time, but all of them are expensive, pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> so, I went well, we, yeah, but I think so, everybody enjoyed that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, but it's yeah. So how is like oh we have this beautiful hotel here at the beach, right? But then it's yeah. how much is that? Oh, three hundred dollar. Oh, how much is that? Five hundred dollar. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's yeah. this restaurant which is very good. Oh, how much is that? Oh, thirty dollars each. Dish. Yeah. Right? So it's like, oh, how much yeah. is that mariscada? Oh, eighteen dollars. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right. That's yeah, it's unbelievable. Right that's unbelievable. Yeah. So I got, I got like, oh, that's that's so much for me, I guess. Right. I I gotta stay at home and, and save some money. Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> Yeah, it's better to make a barbecue in the house, you know. <laughs> yes, that's better. That's better. That's better. And also, don't forget that this month, right, Ronald Alexis, we have five weeks. Five weeks. That's what we have. This month, Ronald Alexis, we have five weeks, like July. July and August is forever. It's like five weeks in the, in the calendar. So you can mm -hmm. check, yes, five weeks. Unbelievable. Okay. So, we gotta save some money so we can survive. <laughs> so, <like. laughs> That's true. Okay, thank you so much for being here. Let me tell you the attendance really quick. Uh, when you hear your beautiful name, say I'm here or present. Just let me let me check. Okay, my God, you here? Um. Okay. 
Um, Camilo, you're here, right? Oh, good evening. Thank you. Yeah, I'm here. Good night, teacher. Thank you. Um, uh, Martinez de Lopez, that's Ana Beatriz. I'm here, teacher. Wonderful. Welcome. Nice to see you one more time. Cesar Aparicio, gentlemen. Good evening. Cesar? No, Cesar? Okay. Tadwin <coughs> Blanco. Tadwin Blanco. No? Okay. What about Delmi Amaya? Present teacher. Thank you so much and welcome. Nice to have you. Thanks God you're safe, right? Efraín Emilio Acevedo. Efraín? No, he isn't. Okay. What about Stephanie Sarai? Present teacher. Oh, thank you so much, Stephanie. Welcome. Franklin, Franklin Magaña. Franklin Magaña. No, he isn't. Okay. What about Geraldine? Geraldine, are you here? No? No, she isn't. What about uh, Hebel Tobar Galeas? Hebel Tobar Galeas? No, she isn't. Okay. What about Ingrid Flores? Thank you, Ingrid. Nice to have you one more time. Irma. Segura. Present teacher. Thank you, Irma, and welcome. Nice to have you. Jesus Escobar. Yes. Jesus, are you here? No, he isn't. Uh, Jose Vaquerano. Jose Vaquerano. No, he isn't. Uh, Juan David Madrid. Present teacher. Thank you, Juan. It's nice to hear your voice again. Catherine <coughs> Rivera. <coughs> Catherine Rivera, no, she isn't. What about Kevin Flores? Gentlemen, no, he isn't. What about Lucia Cepeda? Here I am, teacher. Wonderful and welcome. Nice to have you. Melvin Diaz. Melvin. Your chair. Thank you, Melvin. Welcome again. Uh, Merin Carranza. Daniela Carranza. No, she Daniela? Daniela Carranza? No, she isn't. What about Milagro de la Paz Jimenez? I'm here, mister. Wonderful. Welcome, Milagro. Welcome. Mirna Landos. Presentation. <laughs> Sorry for that dog. Barking. Really strong. Nelson Zeron? Nelson? No, he isn't. What about Patricia Esmeralda? Present. Thank you, Patricia. Very good. Uh, Patricia um, Castellanos? Good evening, teacher. Thank you, Patricia. Hello. And welcome. Thank Ronald you. Alexis Martinez. Your teacher. Good evening. Well, good evening and welcome. Thank you. Roxana Diaz. Good evening, I'm here. Nice to hear your voice again, young lady. Sandra Asensio. Present teacher, voy en camino. Oh, try careful, okay? Try careful. Carefully, thank you so much. Sandra Rivas. Present teacher. Try carefully, young lady. Be safe, be safe. Okay, let me check the chat here I'm soon, really quick. Teacher, uh, teacher, I couldn't hear my name. Oh, Vaquerano, Jose, ahorita, Jose, just give me a minute. Jose Vaquerano. Okay, ahorita, Jose, very good. También tengo a Sandra Asensio, ahorita Sandra Asensio. Bueno, ya me dijo that you're driving, right? I'm sorry. I forgot. Emilio, okay, Emilio, ahorita, just give me a minute, Emilio. Welcome, it's nice, it's nice to see you that, it's nice to, See that you're you're safe, right? Because I was watching the news and there were like some people like oh, having troubles. Okay. Teacher, oh Daniela Meri. Okay, Daniela ahorita. Meri. Meri. Okay. Um, Geraldine. Okay, Geraldine. Ahorita. Thank you so much. Okay, okay. 
Uh, Emilio, Jesús, Eduardo, ok, ahorita Jesús. Give me a minute. You know, what, you know why, Jesús? My, my second name is, is Jesús también. Entonces, cuando solía trabajar en el call center, me decían, oh, yo decía, thank you for calling, this is Jesus, how may I help you? And customers, they used to say, oh my gosh, finally, please, Jesus, help me with this. That was quite funny. Mm -hmm. <laughs> And then at the end, I used to transfer the call to the um, to somebody else because <laughs> I couldn't help it. Oh, oh, that was back in the day when I was young. Okay. That was so great. <laughs> thing, we're gonna work. Just expect and wishes. That's the thing we're gonna worry really quick. Let's take a look at this first. Main houses. Okay, Juan David, help me out, please. Read this in the phrases that we have here. Make a wish. Okay. How, uh, how your uh, life, lifestyle, style, excuse me, start my own business, business, enjoy life more, add uh, more hours, add more hours to today. The day. Uh, I told I told me I told me watch the oh you don't see this yellow one? yellow uh, yes okay it's like do volunteer <laughs> work sorry for oh, your sorry okay. <laughs> excuse me I I don't watch <laughs> <laughs> okay go back uh, to school uh in private uh, my person personality move to a new home. Make new friends, spend more time with uh, my family. Thank you so much. Okay, do you understand all of these like expressions or let's say or wishes that we have here? Do you understand all of them? Do you yeah, have any I questions? Sure. Okay, perfect. Oh, Jose, no problem, Jose. Thank you so much for letting me know. Wonderful. Do you understand all of these uh, phrases, right? Have a healthier lifestyle. Oh, that's a good one. My new friends, that's a good one, right? Um, Make a wish. Okay, somebody brought here. Oh, that's wonderful. It's nice to hear that. It's nice to hear, well, nice to read that. Uh, so we have these, let's say, things that we are like, we wish for, right? So we have these kind of things, like it depends on the way you like, you want to see in the future or the way like like you would like to be or would like to get something like this one right uh, as you may know right it, sometimes things are difficult to to get that's for sure uh, even though we wish something that <laughs> i mean wish like like heavily you know what i mean like we wish, oh i wish i could do this but sometimes life is, is telling is telling you like oh Sorry for you, but that's not gonna happen. We're gonna check these questions, okay? Some of these things you would like to do. Tell a partner, okay? So, vamos a tomarle captura ahorita. Necesito que le tomen captura a estos que está acá. Please, thank you. Okay, thank you. Luego tenemos la next question. It says, uh, which of these wishes would be easy to achieve? Which would be difficult? or impossible and then the other one what other things would you like to change about your life so these wishes are about our life let's say right it's about our life so um let's work really quick with the second one which is this one okay this one here uh, let's work with you, Ronald Alexis Martinez. Which of these wishes would be easy to achieve? We have some of them. Uh, which ones enjoy do you... life more. Enjoy oh. life more. Oh, how come? How come? Um, take it easy about uh, many aspects of my life, for example. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Um, Yes. Okay. Um, uh, lifestyle lifestyles nowadays is very stressful. The traffic, uh, the bills, for example, 
the many things to do in the work or at a job, but we need to take it easy about our life because this impact or healthy. That is true. That is absolutely true. Very good. Thank you. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that's that's true, right? Like, um, well, it depends on our jobs, right? Sometimes we have jobs that are, let's say, um, somehow have different responsibilities, and those are kind of like heavy to to deal with. Right? Not an easy thing. What about what was your opinion about that, Camilo Rivera? Which of these wishes? be easy to achieve. I'm sorry, Camilo, your mic is off. Your mic is off. Sorry. Okay. Okay. Sorry. I think it's the number one. Have a healthy lifestyle. That's a, what everyone's in the world, you know, to have a healthy. How, how this thing is easy. What? How this thing, like, uh, have a healthier lifestyle is easy to achieve? Um, what can I say? Mm -hmm. How can it be easy? Oh. Yes, like, give me an example, like, how this thing could be easy for me to achieve? Uh, I think it's try to do, to not to do the wrong things. Oh, I don't understand too much. I mean, because this is have a healthier lifestyle, right? Mm -hmm. Do you understand this question of healthier lifestyle? Healthier lifestyle. Yes. Mm -hmm. mm. What is that thing related to? Ronald, can you help me, please? Thank you. Yeah, help me, help me, please. Yeah, sure. Uh, I'm agree with Camilo, and sure. we need to take uh, more responsibility about our bodies mm -hmm. because mm -hmm. every day we get more old, and we need to take uh, care about our bodies and uh, have a more uh, healthy or. Uh, how can I say that? We have more, more organization. Yeah, uh, we need to take care of our poor food. Uh, we need to uh, do more exercise. And I don't know. <laughs> oh, thank you so much. I appreciate your comments. Very good. Okay, Patricia, do you want to add something else to this? Uh, like comments about have a healthier lifestyle? Patricia Which Patricia? Oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> what kind of things? No, I, I mean, they they were have... talking about have a healthier lifestyle. I have a healthier lifestyle. Like what's well, your opinion about how, like me as a person, I can get a better, healthier lifestyle? Uh, yeah, maybe uh, doing exercise. Um, uh, taking care about my diet, about things I I get uh, every day. Um, um, I think <laughs> that's that's it. I think. Uh, let me think. Um, uh, take more time uh, to rest. That's true. Yeah. Thank you so much. Okay, mm -hmm. what about you, Patricia Esmeralda Garcia? Which would be difficult or impossible? Um, Patricia I Garcia. I for hours. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Patricia, too. <laughs> How a healthy lifestyle. Uh, I mean, I mean, which of these wishes, which would be difficult it's, it's or difficult. impossible? It's difficult. It's difficult. <laughs> to have a healthy life, it's difficult because and so all and fast food are present in my life. <laughs> and it's very dif difficult uh, to go to the gym and because 
it is far away. <laughs> okay, yeah, you see? That is a good point. As you may know, <laughs> that's why I love this thing that is called like staying alive. Which because everybody everybody's different. And that's one like good thing or maybe a bad thing, right? Like Camilo and also uh I think that was let me see Alexis, right? They were talking about that have a healthier lifestyle is easier, right, to achieve. But Patricia Garcia is telling, oh, that is difficult or sometimes impossible to do it, right? I um, know so, it's not easy. <laughs> yeah, I mean, because it's she's mentioned that we have a, a bunch of junk, junk. We got a lot of responsibilities. Well, the, the ones who got family, you know, we got a lot of responsibility <laughs> and the time is a little bit short. It's getting exactly. short every day. Exactly. So, Exactly. We try to to try to do the best, you know, and try to sleep eight hours a day <laughs> at night. Eight hours at least, right? But I yeah, yes. good evening. Mm -hmm. How are you? You good? I'm pretty pretty good oh. in you. Can't complain. Do me a favor. Like the same question, which would be difficult or impossible to achieve? Um, <laughs> to me, I think that move to a new home. Because I don't have money to buy a house. I would like to have my own house, but I don't have the possibility right now to to do that. That was very clever and straight to the point. Everything is expensive. <laughs> I was I was as I was talking at the beginning of the class, right? Houses. Yeah. Houses like Jesus. I don't know why. I mean, people think that we're rich, <laughs> but everything is like like overrated i guess everything's overrated i don't know why thank you so much Adai. that was a very good point okay uh like the last one is what other things would you like to change about your life let's begin with pilago de la paz tell me please what other thing would you like to change about your life? i would like to change mm, my my habits, some habits, <laughs> referring to lifestyle. Mm -hmm. uh, I would like to, right. to have a, a better lifestyle because um, I uh, almost always used to eat greasy food and I know that that is bad. I would like to go to the gym, but I have not time. Um, there are a lot of things that I would like to do, but I, I cannot do it. I'm sorry to hear that. I'm sorry to hear that, and I wish that that you could, that you, that you like, that you can have the chance to 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 accomplish those, right? And as I, as I was mentioned in before, like is sometimes it's, it's because we don't have like Camilo was talking about the time we don't have too much time to, to do stuff that we want to do yes mm -hmm. uh, but, like to buy, but, uh, thank you so much for sharing that okay um but we're work with the following thing which is about this conversation okay sorry i'm going something here Emilio, puede participar Emilio? Ah, oh, no, he's oyente. Okay, very good. Thank you so much. Le puso ahí, oyente. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> Geraldine, okay. Can you do me a favor? Describe the picture, Geraldine, please. Excuse me, Geraldine. Describe, describe the picture, please. Thank you. Yes. Is how to person or two friends and I don't know how to say okay where are you they having a nice conversation thank you so much Camille. that was very good Geraldine where are they Geraldine I don't hear you the Google oh. teacher Oh, you don't hear me very good. Okay, sorry. Right. We're gonna switch with somebody else. Let's check. Um, Ana Beatriz Martinez de Lopez. Where are they? Where do you think 
are. They are talking. I mean, no, uh, where, where are they? What is the place? Ah, where are they? Yes. Uh, they they are in the puente. I don't know. No. On a bridge. It's a a bridge. bridge. Okay. How do they uh, look like? What? How do they look like? Uh, happy. <laughs> they are yes. happy. Uh, and enjoy it about the, the conversation. Thank you so much for sharing that. Okay, vamos a escuchar la conversation really quick. Let's listen. Page 19, exercise 8, conversation. I wish I could, part A. Listen and practice. So, are you still living with your parents, Dylan? Yes, I am. But sometimes I wish I had my own apartment. Why? Don't you like living at home? It's okay. But my parents are always asking me to come home early. I wish they'd stop worrying about me. Yeah, parents are like that. Plus, they don't like my friends. And they won't stop criticizing them. I wish life weren't so difficult. So why don't you move out? Hey, I wish I could, but where else can I get free room and board? Page 19. Exercise 8. Conversation. I wish I could. Part A. Listen and practice. So, are you still living with your parents, Dylan? Yes, I am. But sometimes I wish I had my own apartment. Why? Don't you like living at home? It's okay. But my parents are always asking me to come home early. I wish they'd stop worrying about me. Yeah, parents are like that. Plus, they don't like my friends. And they won't stop criticizing them. I wish life weren't so difficult. So, why don't you move out? Hey, I wish I could, but where else can I get free room and board? Okay, let's get some questions. Page nine. Okay, so we have this question. So number one, well, two and four. Uh, Dylan hates living at home. Dylan's parents are always asking him to be home early. Dylan thinks his life is difficult. Dylan is going to move out. Soon. Okay, so these are the three and four questions, right? We have one there one more time the audio, so I will play the audio again so you can listen. And then after this, the two and four questions, okay? Page 19, exercise 8, conversation. I wish I could, part A. Listen and practice. So, are you still living with your parents, Dylan? Yes, I am. But sometimes I wish I had my own apartment. Why? Don't you like living at home? It's okay. But my parents are always asking me to come home early. I wish they'd stop worrying about me. Yeah, parents are like that. Plus, they don't like my friends. And they won't stop criticizing them. I wish life weren't so difficult. So, why don't you move out? Hey, I wish I could, but where else can I get free room and board? Okay. Okay. So, that's it. True and false. Dylan hates living at home. That is true or false? Yes, true. True. It's true. Um, it's true. Yeah. Dylan hates it's living false. at home. Uh, it's really relative. Relative. I, I think it's false because he said it's okay. Yeah. But. You, Patricia. But. Like. But like, he don't feel comfortable. But he, he wants uh, to live. But he wants to live alone. <laughs> I think it's true because yeah, he don't feel comfortable true. living with their parents. It's okay. Is. Patricia was talking. Why do you like living at home? It's okay. Yeah. It's okay. So that means. 
That is? He hates that leaving is, alone? That is false, right? It's false, yes. That's true. That's true. So she doesn't hate that. Just like you. What about number two? Dylan's parents always are asking him to be home. It's true. It's true. That is true, actually. That's true. What about number three? It's true. Yeah, true. 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 That's true. true. Very good. And the last one is going to be false. 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 Excuse me? False. That's absolutely false, false. right? False. Absolutely false. Yeah. False. So we can get a free ruin. Yeah, that's that's true, right? Okay. I would like to live like bit like Dylan. Okay, extra <laughs> thing. I just think by almost on a conversation. Listen to the rest of the conversation. What changes would Harry like to make in his life? Yes? So, aquí vamos a poner atención a Harry. What are those changes that he would like to make? What changes would Harry like to make in his life? Okay. Page 19. Exercise 8. Part B. Listen to the rest of the conversation. What changes would Harry like to make in his life? Yeah, it's sometimes pretty hard to pay the rent. I'm thinking of finding a new job. Really? What kind of job would you like? I'm not sure, but I wish I worked somewhere else. I'm tired of this place. I need to live somewhere more exciting. I know what you mean. Hey, maybe we could move to a different city. We could even be roommates. Yeah, uh, maybe. Okay, I'm sorry. Page 19, Exercise 8, Part B. Listen to the rest of the conversation. What changes would Harry like to make in his life? Yeah, it's sometimes pretty hard to pay the rent. I'm thinking of finding a new job. Really? What kind of job would you like? I'm not sure, but I wish I worked somewhere else. I'm tired of this place. I need to live somewhere more exciting. I know what you mean. Hey, maybe we could move to a different city. We could even be roommates. Yeah, uh, maybe. Okay. Here we have. Okay, so what are those? What are those changes? What is the first one? Find new jobs. Yes, change jobs, right? Uh, change new, jobs. New work. Very good. And what else? Changing the city. Live in some other city. Different city. Exactly, right. In a place that is more exciting. Yes. Very good. Great job. Okay. Let's get back to the conversation. Okay, that we have here. Tome la captura, please. Thank you. Sorry for that. Vapatika. Uh, as usual, right? I will open the breaker rooms five or six minutes so you can practice this conversation, okay? Yes, in the breaker rooms. Again, don't forget that this is about practicing. So practice as much as you can. Sure, it's it's okay. If someone can send this picture like on the group that we have available on website, that would be nice. Okay. Uh, let me give me a minute so I can open those. You see, groups of three and two. Okay. Let me check the time. Okay. Yes, here we go. In the main room, we're going to have Geraldine, Jose Baquerano. And Ronald Alexis, you three stay here in the main room. The rest of you, please join your classmates so you can practice this conversation. One more time. Geraldine, eh, Jose Alejandro Vaquerano, and Ronald Alexis, you stay here in the main room. The rest of you, please okay. join, join your classmates in the breaker rooms. Thank you so much. Okay, so there you go. Please join your classmates. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Nelson and Sandra Asensio, please join. 
Emilio, Irma. Oh, Emilio, he's driving, right? I'm sorry. Irma, eh, Mirna. Okay, I'm sorry. Okay. Juan David, you need to join Juan David. I think he's trying to join, but he, it's like, Kevin, you need to join as well. Sorry. Oh, okay, Kevin, I'm sorry, okay? Ahorita le cambio, le cambio ahí. Thank you. Okay, for the rest of the of the, your classmates, the ones that I told you here in the main room, you can start practicing right now, okay? <clears throat> so are you still living in your parents, Dylan? Yes, I am, but sometimes I wish I had to. I have my own apartment. Why don't you like living at home? It's okay, but my parents are always asking me to, to come home early. I wish they had stopped worrying about me. <laughs> yeah, parents I are like that. Plus, they don't like my friends. They don't stop criticizing them. I wish life weren't, weren't so difficult. So why don't you move out? Hey, I wish I could, but else, but where else can I get free room and board? Excuse me, teacher. Uh, uh, yeah. Juan David, you can stay here and practice with your partners in the main room because because um, Kevin Flores he's like just here in the class. Okay. Conversation. Excuse me. So are you still living with you? Yes, I know. I like that. Uh, plus, they don't like my friends and they won't stop uh, criticizing them. I wish life weren't so difficult. So why don't you move out? Hey, I wish I could. But where else can I get free room and board? Four. Four. Are you hurry? Okay. Yes, sir. So, are you still living with your parents, Dylan? Yes, I am, but sometimes I wish I had my own apartment. Why? Don't you like uh, living at home? It's okay. But my parents are always asking, asking me to come home early, which uh, I wish they, they uh, stop uh, worrying about me. Yeah, parents are like that. Plus they don't, plus they don't like my friends, and uh, they won't stop criticizing uh, them. them. I I wish life uh, life uh, weren't so difficult. So why don't you move out? Hey, I wish for uh, but where else can I get a free room and up uh, and board? Okay. Okay. Uh, what about Irma? She did it, she did it uh, already. <laughs> it's you, Petition. <laughs> yes. Hi, Irma. It was quiet. We were waiting for you, right? That was very good. Uh -huh. Yes. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. I'm Hola. Leaving. Hi. Maybe with Irma you? or me. Okay. Uh, Harry. Well, you, Dylan. Oh, okay. Is that for you? Yeah. So, are you still living with your parents, Dylan? Yes, I am, but sometimes I wish I had my, my own apartment. Why don't you like living at home? It's okay. But my parents are always asking me to come home early. I wish they they stop worrying about me. Yeah, par parents are like that. 
Plus, they don't like my friends and they won't stop uh, criticizing them. I wish life weren't, weren't so difficult. So why don't you move out? Hey, I wish I, I could, but where else uh, can I hear the room and board? Yeah. Melvin, okay. you, uh, you, now I am Harry, you right? Harry. Uh -huh. and Irma Dylan. Yeah. Uh, so, are you still living with your parents, Dylan? Yes, I am, but sometimes I wish I had my own apartment. Why? Don't you like living at home? It's okay, but my parents are always asking me to home early. I wish they stop worrying about me. Yeah, parents are, are like that. Plus, they don't like my friends and they won't stop criticizing them. I wish life weren't so difficult. So, why don't you move out? Hey, I wish I could, but where else can I get free room <laughs> and board? Okay. Very good. That's wonderful. Great okay. job. Thank you, teacher. Yes, very good, the two Thank of you. you. It working like that because everything you're doing for home or to go home earlier, I wish they would stop worrying about me. Yeah, parents are like that. Plus, they don't like my friends. They won't stop criticizing them. I wish it were so difficult. So why don't you move out? Hey, I wish I could, but what else can I get from free room and board? Oh, I hey. love this. I love this conversation. I love it. It's just like uh, parents are always like that, right? <laughs> they they don't like my <laughs> yeah. friends. They don't like my friends. Yeah, yeah. Sure. I agree sure. with that. <laughs> mm -hmm. They always say like that. <laughs> no, like if you are a parent, uh, you should know how how it feels, right? <laughs> like. <laughs> No, listen, that muchachito, but that muchachita, no. I'm sorry. I don't like, it. I don't like The it. parents don't always get jealous. That's right. Okay, oh that was very good. That's a good conversation. That's why I love it. Okay, we're going to watch a video which is related to the uh, topic, as you may see. We're working with making wishes. That is the thing we're going to work. So I would like to show you a video so you can uh, remember how the grammar structure works. Okay. Page nine. So, um, oh my gosh, let's listen and watch, okay? Hello, everyone. By the end of this class, you'll learn how to express present wishes that you have about your personal life, career, and health. For example, you'll be able to make the following expressions. I wish I didn't live with my parents. I wish I had a different job. I wish I I wear it thinner. Before I present the material, what I would like for you to do is to listen to an audio program that illustrates how this topic is used. Your task is to listen carefully and complete some questions that I'll have for you at the end of the audio program. So are you still living with your parents, Terry? I'm afraid so. I wish I had my own apartment. Why? Don't you like living at home? It's okay, but my parents are always asking me to be home before midnight. I wish they'd stop worrying about me. Yeah, parents are like that. And they expect me to help around the house. I hate housework. I wish life weren't so difficult. So, why don't you move out? Hey, I wish I could. But where else can I get free room and board? Yeah, it's sometimes pretty hard to pay the rent. I'm thinking of finding a new job. Really? What kind of job would you like? I'm not sure, but I wish I worked somewhere else. I'm tired of this place. I need to live somewhere more exciting. I know what you mean. Hey, maybe we could move to a different city. We could even be roommates. Yeah, uh, maybe. 
Now let me start by presenting this structure. The first thing that I would like to point out is that we use wish plus a past tense in order to refer to present wishes. For example, if I have a situation that is true for me, such as I live with my parents and I would like for that to be something different, that is a wish that I have. In order for me to express that idea, I will say I wish I didn't live with my parents or I wish I had my own apartment. Um, if I think that life is difficult, for example, this is my present situation. If I want to express a wish that I have about that particular situation, then I will say I wish life were easier or I wish it weren't so difficult. Let's try to make sense of the examples that are on this chart. In order for us to understand those examples, what I would like to do is I would like to propose this formula here at the bottom. And so what we want to do is we want to take certain situations that exist in our lives and then we want to express wishes about those situations. The example that is stated here is I live with my parents. I would like for that to be something different, right? And so in order for me to express that idea, I'm going to have a subject. So in this case, the subject is I, then this is going to follow wish plus the subject again. Now, the subject could be you again, or it could be another person, right? I wish I, and then the verb in its past form. So in this case, it happens to be that it's on a negative form. So we use didn't plus live. So I wish I didn't, and then whatever compliment, right? didn't live with my parents there we go there we go and as you can see the other example is quite similar I wish I had my own apartment in that second example we can see that it's no longer in its negative form so therefore we're gonna use the verb in the past so the example will be I wish I had my own apartment so this is going to be in the past so let's try to make sense of that second example there I can't move out so what happens there I can't move out the only thing that changed was that I'm using a model verb instead of a regular verb um, but what you gotta remember here is that the model verb can, the past of that is could. And so it's basically the same concept, right? We're going to say, I wish. And then we're going to have a subject again. I wish I. So what is the past of can? Well, we can easily say that it is could, right? There we go. And so that's basically what we're going to put here. I wish I could. move out. Now let's try to make sense of the example life is difficult. As you can see the verb that we're using there is the verb to be. And something that I would like for you to learn at this point is that whenever we express wishes we're gonna use where for all of the pronouns. It doesn't matter if we're talking about I, he, she, it, we, you, or they. For all of them we're going to use where. And so that's basically what's um, here at the bottom. After which, where is used with all pronouns. So if we think about the example, life is difficult, and we want to express a wish, then we can say, I wish. And the subject, again, life. Where easier. Uh, and of course, you can make that in a negative statement. I wish life weren't so difficult. But it's basically the same pattern that we're following. And the last example, my parents won't stop worrying about me. Well, what happens here is that I'm using a contraction there. So my parents won't stop worrying about me. In that particular case, I'm going to turn want or will not into would, right? So 
I wish and in this case subject my parents would stop and then whatever compliment right what kind of wishes do you have about your life and as I mentioned at the beginning of class we want to express personal wishes we want to express family wishes we want to express health wishes we want to express professional wishes if you will so I'm just gonna have a series of wishes here right so what kind of wishes do you have about your bedroom so an easy example I wish my bedroom were bigger what kind of wishes do you have about your school or job well I wish my job were easier what kind of wishes do you have about your appearance the way that you look well I wish I were thinner what kind of wishes do you have about your family I wish I had two children right and what kind of wishes do you have about your possessions well I don't have a car so I wish I had a car that's a, just a quick example uh, and what kind of wishes do you have about your skills I don't know how to program computers I wish I knew how to program computers and so on and so forth so I would like for you to come up with your own examples about the kind of wishes that you have about and the so what do we have here as example my parents what do we have here is pretty much let's say the grammar structure how we can use wish plus past tense to refer to the present wishes right so the things that we are right now here like living uh, and we can express a wish we can use past tense to do so right like uh, I live with my parents right so uh, that's my reality now my reality is that I live with my parents mm -hmm. okay so so I can say I wish I didn't live with my parents right or I wish I have my own apartment so I'm, I'm wishing about something that is in real life now but I can use the past tense to, to do it yeah so uh, also about life um, you can use adjectives if you see right tenemos adjectives and we can use the negative form if you want I wish it were easier right mm -hmm. or in, in fact also see if you have your job right you can say, I wish my job were easier let's say right. so, yeah. so you can change you can change the, the thing in the now yes or I wish I don't know um um let's see my profession uh were easier right let's say things things like that we can and we want with that be careful because we can use good okay we can use good and we can use word when we talk about those, okay, when the context is like, uh, with my realities, for example, somebody said, um, I can't afford for a house because it's expensive, right? I don't have the money. So you can make a wish, like using that, I wish I could move out or I wish I could afford uh, for oh, a house, yeah. let, let's say, right? Mm -hmm. So, um, and when we have, my parents want to stop worrying about me. Well, usually that expression, like maybe we can wish but if you're a parent if you're a parent this thing is naturally right comes naturally yeah like you are worried about your son or your daughter about your children always like as a mother yes. or father like instantly like you, you're always worried about them like uh, why yes. are they coming late or why are they not here right like yes. you're always worried oh they need some some money to pay this uh the university or they need some money to to go to the doctor right uh or they need some i don't know you need to take care of them all the time so uh that is that is something that i think we cannot stop doing i guess i guess so, uh, as a parent yeah kind parent. of I'm difficult talking i'm talking about you okay <laughs> <laughs> okay no, 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 it's okay i'm agree I I'm talking about I'm talking about you. Like if you have like children, right? That because well, my mom she's always like, 
is you know, like sometimes worried about me, like the things that I do. Yes. Lazarito. Exactly, exactly. Let's try it. Let's try it. Okay, let's work with, with some uh examples here. Which of words or phrases often goes with verbs? So we have these verbs, right? Mm -hmm. And we have be, play, have, and move. So these are the mm -hmm. verbs. And then we have these phrases uh, like guitar, let's say, or free oh, time, time, happier, okay. healthy, my own. So which one goes with be, let's say? Okay, be happier. Yes. <clears throat> right? Yes. Happier. happier. Very good. Happier. Okay. What about with play? Guitar. 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 Okay, guitar and soccer. Soccer. Okay. And soccer. Okay. Thank you so much. What about have? My own room. New place. Or or free time. A okay. new play. My own room. Somebody told me. And what else? More, More free, free time. time. More free time. Free time. Okay, perfect. What about we move? To a new place. Oh, new place. To a uh, new place. To a new place. Right. And the other one is? My somewhere else. else. Somewhere else. I am somewhere else. else. Okay, somewhere. Somewhere else. Somewhere, somewhere else. else. Somewhere else. I'm sorry, my mistake. Okay. Entonces, aquí es donde utilizamos this vocabulary and this verb to make wishes, right? Yeah. Right? So I can say, let's take a look here. Okay. I wish. Okay. I, I wish. Could... Okay. What is next? Super. I, I could. could I very good. Could, I could. I could be healthier. Play. Um, Okay. Play guitar. Okay, guitar. Very good. Yes. Right. I wish I could play guitar, right? Because the mm -hmm. context is I cannot. I cannot play. Right? Yes. So I wish yes. I could play guitar. guitar. Very good. Okay. So this is the way that we can make wishes, right? Here we have like the verbs and then we have a complement. And then we yes. can use the past tense. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Like at the end, it depends on the context and it depends on, on the way you feel. Let's make another one with uh, have, with have, okay? So I wish, okay, what is next? I could. Oh, ya no vamos a utilizar could, vamos a ocupar otro. Oh, okay. sorry. And that's okay, oh, okay. the right. <laughs> okay. I have. I wish have. I would have. I would have. I would I have. have. I I would have, I would have, 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 have mm -hmm. my own room. Exactly, my own room, right? Well, I have it, right? Okay. <laughs> like, but here in the context is when you live alone, you know what I mean? Not with your parents. You know, with your parents, right? Like, like you have your own room, maybe, right? But here the context is like you live alone, like independently, you know what I mean? But that is the context, right? So if you notice, it's not something like difficult. The difficult part, I think, is the past tense, right? The past tense uh, that, mm -hmm. that sometimes give us a little bit of, let's say, uh, troubles when, when it comes, okay? But okay. but if you got this structure of how to do it, right? Well, that is easier for you. Okay. Any, any question about this? Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, give me a minute. Voy a borrar esto, sorry. Okay. Okay, okay, thank you so much. Okay. Thank you. Okay, it's time. So these are the wishes that we started at the beginning, right? So if you see, here we have just the expressions, and we can use these phrases to make wishes, right? So you have, this is about your life, right? Or, or the way you live. 
So mm -hmm. uh, you can use this one to make wishes, right? Um, like move to a new house. And you can be you can play with these verbs that we have here. We have go, improve, make, and spend. So you can play with them, right? You can use could, you can use would, also you can use, I don't know, uh the past tense. Um, the verb in the past tense, okay. Exactly, right. Just to make I think it's okay. time to go to bed. Thank you so much for being here. Be nice okay. and be kind, and we will see you tomorrow. Thank you. Thank you so much okay. for your Thank you. Okay, see you night. tomorrow. Thank you, everybody. Good night. Good night. Bye -bye. Have a good night. Thank you so much. You do the same.